Hi, I'm Shirley Esty, and today what I'm going to be doing is showing you a couple of exercises to do when you want to activate multiple areas of the body. And we're going to do that using resistance bands. So for today, what you want is you want to grab the resistance band and you want to place it above the level of your knees. With the resistance band tied around your thighs above the knees, you want to be on your hands and your knees. You want your knees to be about hip width apart and then your hands will go directly under your shoulders. In this position here, what you want to do is you want to think of actively separating your knees so they remain hip width apart and then you want to think of gently pushing the palms of your hands into the floor while pulling your shoulder blades away from your ears. At this point now, you want to make sure we engage the core. Otherwise, we may find our lower back sinks down like so. So engage the core. You want to imagine pulling your belly button in towards your spine, keeping your back flat, gently pushing the palms of your hands into the floor to activate the muscles around the shoulder blades. And while thinking of separating those knees, and from here, what you want to do is just gently push and lift one leg up. And then you're going to do the same with the other. Alternating going from right to left. just like this. The second exercise that I'm going to show is a variation of a high plank. So with this exercise, once again, the resistance band will be tied around your thighs. You're going to move into a plank position. You're going to ensure that you're not shrugging your shoulders. And at the same time, we're going to activate the core as well as those glute muscles again. The resistance band is tied around our thighs. Our hands are underneath our shoulders. You're going to think to engage your stomach core muscles by imagine pulling the belly button in towards your spine. And then from here, what you want to do is make sure your shoulders aren't shrugged. So you pull those shoulder blades away from your ears. And then you once again alternate moving one leg and then the other. If you have any questions about these exercises, please don't hesitate to contact me at Kitsilano Physiotherapy Clinic.